Hi there, welcome to the next video and in this video I will show you how you can enumerate over a list to access the index along with the value. So if I go back to my previous example where I showed you the for loop for these different elements. So this was the for loop we created in the previous video where we looped over countries, inflation and some number and then did some operation like multiplication, sum or uh, power as well as simply print the value. So different operations just to explain the for loop and its uh, capabilities in terms of taking the oper mathematical operations as well. So in this video as I mentioned I will show you how you can index along with the value. Uh, if you remember from my previous video lists values are associated with the specific index value. So India is at index 0, China is at index 1, Russia at 2, UK is 3, USA is 4 right because if you need to access a list you specify the index number if you remember from the list videos so what I'll do is I will simply modify this uh, for loop to show you how you can access the index along with the value so index is basically I'll mentioned with I or generally it is said key value uh, in dictionary but here I will since it is index and value so index is specify I am specifying with I in countries by C based on the previous example in and here I will simply say enumerate so enumerate over the countries and then print I comma C that's it right and you will see along with the uh, value now I have the index value similarly here I, I have already chosen so index is I and uh, INF is inflation so I will say I comma INF right but don't forget to say enumerate otherwise you will not get the value so now for each of the inflation value I get the index value similarly for integer value now the benefit is that uh, if you have some sort of an operation based on the index values then uh, you can access them with the i variable or i for variable similarly if there is another operation that you want to perform based on the values then you also have values so basically you have the access of both the elements of a list which is index as well as value so that's mainly i wanted to show you about how you can enumerate over a list and then fetch its index and value and then print it uh, or do any other operation based on your scenario and I'll meet you now in the new video the new topic